A vision for a self-sustaining community in Canyon Country is one step closer to reality. Officials are hoping to make a splash with the Vista Canyon project that's been nearly two decades in the making. Probably would have about 3,500 people living here and probably uh, closer to 5,000 people working here at some point. The community is nestled along the Santa Clara River between Sand Canyon and Jake's Way. <laughs> Crews broke ground in 2015. Backer says his team looked to the future to make the community more accessible. They're constructing a Metrolink station and a transit hub for bus riders. Their hope is to bring everything together in one place. We're trying to make it so easily attainable that you really could walk. You don't really need a car to go everywhere. And that, that was one of our goals from the beginning. Another goal was to build a neighborhood that relies on its own resources. We have a water factory on the west side that treats the liquid portion of sewer and makes it available for recycled water that is used in all the irrigation. We create more water on an annual basis than, than the entire project uses domestic and, and recycled. Planners mark the completion of one phase of the project this week. A new park opened on the east end. I'm going to look forward to seeing residents of all ages enjoy the beautiful Vista Canyon Park and all the opportunities and amenities that it gives. The park brings the playground, basketball courts, and tennis courts, and of course, pickleball. Who knew when we started this project in 2005 that pickleball would rule the world. Backer hopes to have the project completed in the next five to seven years. You know, what we've tried to bring to the table is a commitment to excellence and to making something great. Reporting for Canyons News, I'm Lauren Hanna.